People say with the current high temperatures in Mississippi, it feels like they are living in an open sauna. That's right. Well, 12 News' is Marie Minifield spoke to people on how they are staying cool. Marie. Yes, you all. We visited a few places around the metro to find out how people are coping. We have entered into the dog days of summer where people are just looking for ways to survive the extreme temperatures. But for those who work or play outside, avoiding the heat is impossible. One athlete gives a tip that helps keep him from overheating during practice. Um, I, can, I drink water. I put it on my wrist and um, below my knees, whatever. It kind of cools your body down, get your body temperature back low. So that's kind of what I do. Escaping from the outside heat is not a luxury all can afford. An equestrian farm worker shares the importance of removing pets from the direct high sun exposure. Usually the hottest part of the day to ensure your animal survival. Lots of fans on the horses. Every horse is different. So some of them have two fans. Some of them have bigger fans. And then also throughout the day we bring them out and we'll hose some of them off if they get too sweaty. And then we turn them out at night versus daytime to keep them as much out of the sun as we can. First responders say during this time of the year, it's not uncommon for them to receive calls about a person suffering from a heat-related illness or injury. So it's important for people to continue to keep their body nourished throughout the day. To keep yourself hydrated so, you know, you replenishing all the stuff that you're sweating out. That's basically why you need to stay hydrated with plenty of water, Gatorade, fruits and stuff to keep your nourishing up. Staying hydrated, finding unique ways to cool off, and taking breaks from being outside are a few ways to beat the heat. Now, high temps are expected to stay in the 90s through the week, and we're only one month into summer. Live in Jackson, Marie Menifel, 12 News.